This story appears in the November 2023 issue of Forbes Asia. Subscribe to Forbes Asia. This story is part of Forbes's coverage of China's richest 2023. See the full list here. Yang Weiyin, chairperson of property developer Country Garden and once the richest woman in Asia, slipped 24 spots to number 93 as the company defaulted for the first time in mid-October on a dollar bond interest repayment. The wealth that she shares with her family plummeted almost 90% to $3.6 billion over two years as the debt crisis engulfed the Hong Kong-listed firm amid a prolonged slump in the country's property market. A Country Garden spokesperson says the company has no comment. Earlier that month, the developer warned it wouldn't be able to meet all of its offshore payment obligations, citing significant challenges to sales in a filing to the Hong Kong Stock Exchange. With $188 billion in total liabilities, of which an estimated $17 billion are offshore, the company said in the filing it hired advisors to evaluate its liquidity and capital structure. Warit Promboon, a Hong Kong-based managing partner at research firm Bond Critic, says offshore bondholders in distressed firms like Country Garden typically get 15% of their investment back at best, with other debt obligations, such as paying off suppliers, taxes and other forms of secured debt, taking priority. Investors will get even less than that. With the recovery rate in single digits, if they resort to liquidating the company, according to one analysis done on the company's balance sheet. The spokesperson didn't respond to questions on restructuring. It is now up to the 42-year-old Yang to steer Country Garden through its crisis. In March she officially took over from her father, Yang Kwok Kyung, who transferred his majority stake in the company to Yang in 2007. Country Garden gained some breathing room in September, when it won bondholder approval to extend payments on 14.7 billion yuan worth of onshore bonds by three years. The family, in the meantime, is using their personal wealth to support Country Garden. The father and daughter made an interest-free loan of $300 million to the company and are selling their private jets to boost its cash flow, according to state-affiliated news outlet Kalian. After stepping down as co-chair, the elder Young made his first public appearance in October, visiting a construction site in Foshan, where the company is headquartered. In a separate public statement, Country Garden said the founding family is in China and working as usual, dismissing social media reports that they had fled the country as rumored. But reinvigorating the overall business will be a challenge. Amid China's property downturn, which has shown little sign of improvement despite a raft of recent government support measures, the company's contracted sales are projected to almost have to 180 billion yuan this year from 2022, according to a September research report from Moody's Investors Service.